So I just had a brilliant it. idea about a uh, mob spawner or a mob grinder using that thing. Okay. Just pull one out and watch it nuke stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I thought you were going somewhere <laughs> a lot deeper than that, but uh, no, keep yeah. it simple, dude. Just <laughs> put one down and watch it kill stuff. Is that how that would work? Like, could you literally just create a little floating island out there and just have mobs spawn and get killed by the conduit? Well, I mean, that's what that's what it sounds like. Yeah, I need to go read all the specific details, like the wiki for each of them, because most of I've like watched the videos and read the bullet point features, but I don't know like all the uh, you know super detailed mechanics behind everything. What's up, Sherlock? How are you tonight, Sherlock? Um, where are you at? The end. Okay, I. There's a local penis created to fuck the skills penis helmet. Man, I really, uh. Yeah. I have a lot of good shit on. Not a whole lot more enchanting. We might be able to make our next run at the Wither tonight to get our ship back, or to just kill him and kill him. Uh, I think I am going to go to the end right now. I'm just looking at... Yeah, I have four levels and a few more books I need to apply and everything. So yeah, I'm going to run down to the to the end. And That's where I'm at. Farm Enderman. We are very close to being ready to take this asshole down. Oh, and I want to get some um, some brewing going on over here too, because we have I checked and we have all the materials we need to brew a bunch of good potions. Did we um, have? Did, and what's uh, up, can Solomon? You a, can we grab some iron for an anvil? And what's up, Sierra? Uh, some iron for an anvil. Where the fuck did we put our iron? Remember, we were totally out, but then we got a little when we went mining. Trying to remember if we have iron anywhere. Mm. You want me to just bring an anvil? I'm bringing, yeah, I'll just bring the anvil. It doesn't have a whole lot of health left on it, but yeah, we're going to need to do some more iron mining. We've been needing to do some mining for a long time. Yeah, yeah, and it, and it didn't take you long to uh, get a few um, veins of iron, especially with that TNT. Jeez. Oh, and what's up, Dan? And no worries, Solomon. Um, glad to see you back. Hope you've been doing well. Um... And yeah, the build tonight. Tonight we're going to try to finish leveling up our gear and get maxing out. This is definitely going to be, I think, our best gear. Yeah, and it's ever, nice to know today. that that it won't be hard to do it again. We just need more fucking diamond, so we need, we really need to do mining. We have like <laughs> no diamond and no iron, and a whole lot of gold, <laughs> which does jack shit for us. I'm okay with just doing a shitload of mining. Um, we can go back to the mines of Moria. You know, it's not too far, and really, I would yeah. love to start hollowing that place out. Yeah, let's do it. But yeah, after after, I fucking level my guy up. Well, after we get killed, the wither. Well, we'll need to do a little bit of it before, because we're going to need more iron to build another anvil. Oh, really? Okay, so you're thinking about going Yeah, I mean, I'm bringing an anvil, later. but it's going to break pretty soon. I don't think we're going to... I don't think it'll last enough uses for us to finish maxing out. Okay. Oh. Fine with me. I'm okay with going back to Moria. I mean, okay. it's so cool going back there because we started there how many years ago? That's where we fought a Balrog and what? found a bunch of dead dwarfs. You know... 
Lord of the Rings. <laughs> yeah, I got the reference. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that part where Frodo gets stabbed, but he's wearing the crazy mithril shit. Mithril. And protects him from the troll stab. Member? I member. You member? I member. Oh shit, where's the ender chest? Oh, that's right, we moved it. <laughs> oh, I almost crapped my pants. Thanks. Oops, I crapped my pants. Do you did you do you remember those commercial those Saturday Night Live commercials? Yeah. <laughs> Didn't have Chris Farley. Um, I don't remember. I think so because I think like they had Phil Hartman being you know the commercial guy. And now I use. Oops, I crapped my pants. <laughs> I mean, I feel like in 2018, you could make a legit brand of adult diapers exactly that, and, like, I think you'd be okay to do that. People have a sense of humor about that stuff now. I don't know, man. People get butthurt about the stupid shit. I don't know. If I had a crapping my pants problem, I'd be fine with it. I mean, I'd be bummed that I crap my pants all the time, but I'd be able to have a sense of humor about it. Uh, nothing like playing AC2. AC2, are we talking Assassin's Creed 2? Very ambiguous. AC2. I'm trying to think of what else AC2 would be. Any games that come to mind, Matt, besides Assassin's Creed 2? No. Can you put the anvil down? Fuck you. Fuck you. Fucking serious asshole? Right. Yes, I am. Put it down. God <laughs> damn it. Alright, there you go. Jesus. I have relented. Despite your assholery. Alright, I'm totally going to experience. Yes, it was Assassin's Creed 2. Oh, Ace Combat 2. That, that would have been the other option. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there is an Ace Combat 2. Someone Google Ace Combat 2 because that... I'm pretty sure that's a thing. Wow, I'm already level 11. I, mean, I don't think blast protection would, 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 would probably only help against the wither. Uh, well, it'll help against creepers. <laughs> I mean... Yo, oh, did you see that they're adding the thing with, um... I don't think it's conduit, it's a channeling, the channeling, um... Yes, for the trident. Uh, yeah, so you can supercharge a creeper and then yep. I can hit the arrow. <laughs> yes! That's so awesome! Is like, that what you're thinking? This game is gonna be so cool. Yeah. Um... Wait, can you Google real quick, um... Just what's the best armor for fighting a wither? I'm curious if it says, I, I know it says protection is better than blast protection, but I wanted to follow up on something Bird had said, which I think might be true, which is that there's a cap on each, so beyond level 10, a cum cumulative level 10 of protection, you get no added benefit in that case, in which case you might want to put uh, blast resistance on your last piece. I'll try, I'll try to look it up in a little bit after I... Actually, you know what? I could just stand here and I could look it up now. And let these bastards fill up. Really good. Moved into my own apartment. Nice, Dan. Uh, yeah, having your own place 
is quite off. Nice. Alright, I'm gonna look this up real quick. Um, I'm gonna try to get levels. Best gear for you there. I'm wondering if Blast Protection 4 would be worthwhile on my legs. Alright, it says... Yeah, a lot of these kind of say either or. the wither fight, I mean, is it worthwhile to put on there? Yeah, I think so. I think well, I anything mean, that... I, I mean, I think there's enough undead mobs and... Or, if you're talking blast protection, there's enough times a creeper would hit you that having a little protection from that... Uh, or a gas. Or a gas, yeah. Is there fire... I don't think there's fire protection, is there? There's just potions. Hmm... This is some crap here. This is some crap. A good combo of protection and blast protection is what Reddit says. For a wither, protection 4 on chest and pants, blast protection 4 on head and shoes. I also recommend regen potions and smite by sword. Actually, regen potion would be a really good idea. Hmm. Uh, okay, I'm done with this. I'm, I'm going to go back to the game. Uh, and sorry, I'm way behind on chat, but uh, I meant to reply to that. The Ezio Trilogy for Xbox One. I did play AC2, Brotherhood, and Revelations, and I really enjoyed those games. I would say I generally had a good time with Assassin's Creed games, but I never played anything past Revelations. So nothing three onward. Uh, and watching me inspire you today, that's really good, so I'm, I hope we can inspire. Yeah, it's a great game. I highly recommend it. It is incredibly challenging, as hard as you want to make it, or as easy as you want to make it. Um, yeah. You can really, really get crazy with this game. Yeah, I think as I get older, uh, it becomes easier to play more and more of this game, because you just appreciate There's just a level of depth that I, it's just almost impossible to come by in any other game. Um, and this next update, like, dude, did you see the banners that you can use to place markers on yes, maps. That's gonna make life so easy in the game. Well I'm so I'm, and then the maps fucking on the turtles! Ceiling. Turtles! <laughs> <laughs> I'm super excited about maps on the ceiling so we can get a real legit like um, circular map room going. Oh did it did they say they'd go on the ceiling? I missed that. I, I believe so. Oh that's awesome. And then Prismarine stairs and half slabs. Yep, that's right. Um... I'm pretty sure I saw the thing about the maps being able to place on the ceilings. Now you got me questioning myself. something so yeah uh tabby has uh had her baby i don't know oh, if congratulations. I, I can't remember 
I think I told you she was about to have her baby last time we played, but yeah, yep. she had her baby on Saturday. Oh, congratulations. So yeah, she's tell, been texting Tell her us, I so. said congratulations. Yep, we will. Well, we will... We are soon going to be joining that bandwagon, but it's just so hard to be, not be a parent right now. Well, you know, do, do you do you, man. Do whatever works. Oh, yeah. Definitely been having fun. What level are you at right now? 29 and a sliver. I gonna do on breaking two on... luck of the C3. Do I need luck of the C3? <laughs> luck of the fucking C3. Yeah, I've got luck of the, the C2 protection. on that one. Why not? Okay. What would happen if I try to enchant this with blast protection? Would it overwrite the protection, or is it just? Is it just like So I can do Fortune 3 or Lunar 2. I think I want Fortune 3 on my pickaxe. Oh my god, I love this fucking amount of experience this thing generates. It's nuts. <laughs> like, yeah. uh, I feel like we're cheesing the system here, but <laughs> I don't give a shit anymore. You know what? Like, well, it's a perfectly. It's, it's kind of a perfectly legit thing. There's nothing really. Yeah. I mean, we're, I not, mean, ex we're, not, we're not bending the rules of the game in any way, shape, or form. I know, but it Some of the stuff like clipping through cheap. the nether ceiling, you could maybe say, like, oh, that's. Sort of, you know, but yeah, who fucking cares? I'll just do whatever I feel like doing. And if you. Or anyone else wants to do anything different, I don't fucking care. That's exactly my motto in life. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this is definitely worthy. Oh, shit. <laughs> I broke it. Uh, yeah, dude, my pickaxe is actually the best pickaxe I've ever had, and I had named it appropriately. Oh, you broke the fucking anvil? Oh, here, I told you it was gonna break soon. Look at that pickaxe. Perfect name for the best pickaxe you can have. <laughs> check out this, uh, check out this sword. Alright. I poker. Let's see what you got. Smite 5, Sweeping Edge 3. Okay, I got those. Knockback 2, I got that. You got Looting 3 and Mending. I got Unbreaking 3 and Mending. So I need to get Looting see, on mine. I don't have Looting on I mine. I didn't see either. a point in, of Unbreaking with Mending. I like it because uh, I still prefer to have experience go towards levels. So the... If I can have that much less going to repairing things, I figure that's worth it to me. You're gonna throw me my pickaxe. Fuck my previous pickaxe? Yeah. This one? Yeah. And I'm at level one, so I'm gonna fucking kill these dudes. Thank you. Oh my god, the carnage and the experience. Oh wait, what am I doing? I need to take this armor off. <laughs> there we go, now I'm gaining levels really fast! I forgot to take my armor off! Oh my god, what a difference it makes! Why did I forget? I have 12 iron, that probably is not going to get us an anvil, will it? No, we need 27 iron worth of blocks, plus 4 more, we need 31 iron. Literally half, about half a stack of iron for an animal. Is blast protection five a thing? No, it only goes up to four. All of your uh, armor enchants for like, you know, well, just each one of those, they all go up to four. Protection, uh, fire blast, aspect, is that for sword? Yes. I don't know if you can, I don't know if you can put fire aspect on a sword that has sweeping edge. You might be able to, but... Okay. I'm not sure. You can... Well, I would love to try it, but somebody fucking broke the end of it. Well, you... I'm actually 
actually not really that sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna run back to the um, base and get um I'm gonna start mining. Yeah. Uh yeah, yeah, I guess we can do that. Well, yeah, or you can wait until I get back. I just wanna I'm at level nineteen already, I just wanna keep doing this until uh I have enough levels to mostly finish my gear and shit. Whoa, what's up, well, Falcon Lombardi? Would I eat a poop? Do you want me to go get some? Me? Do you want to go get some iron? Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, that's kind I really of a critical thing now. We don't have an anvil. Yeah, we really need an anvil. So I'm yeah. thinking we go back. I might go back and I go get some iron. Um, I don't know. I'll just go down and start blasting, I guess. And then once I have enough iron, I'll come back. Keep working. Yeah, dude. How many anvils do you think we need? Two? Uh, two should be enough. I mean, I'm close enough to max gear and everything. Okay. And then, uh, yeah, when I get back, I was also gonna do some, um, brewing. Oh, well, that's a cool idea, yeah. Do some uh, regen potions and maybe some splash health, so we can just throw it on the ground and get the health. It's much um, much easier than drinking a potion. Yeah, yeah. So regen. Wait. So you're saying we gulp regen potions ahead of time and then throw health potions as needed? Should I like run in and charge, and you stay back and throw health potions at me and the wither? Um, the sacrificial no. Land. No, I think if we're gonna be, I think we should be just putting out a shitload of damage at that point because I think he'll go down really fast. I think so too. Um, we both I think we know this is not a, this isn't a raid. I wish <laughs> we could do what we did before and ride our horses <laughs> in <laughs> and have our horses take all the damage while while we murder the wizard. Oh, that's right. We we, we charged in after the wizard, didn't we? Yep. On horseback. That was pretty epic. I'm it was. Lie. It was. That was a really, really showdown in Old Tucson. Mines of Moria Fortress. All right. Um, I guess I better unload my stuff here. They're, all these chests are just so empty. It's so weird. I like discovering an abandoned city. Yeah. Yeah, I definitely, uh, it's, it's nice having a reason to be back over in your world. Right, come on. Yeah, you know, I gotta say, the Elitur really changed, uh, the game. Yeah, it really changed the game. It's amazing how one item can make such a big impact. Oh, nice. We have like 20 stacks of steak, of mutton. Oh, I brought that all over from our other base. Oh, good call. Yeah, because we were running so low on food. Like, we literally had used like all of our cooked food at uh, Sky Island, so. Eden Prime Village, the Skyway. Oh, yeah. Alright, level 30. Um, I really gotta put mending on this pickaxe. Yeah, thankfully I have mending on everything. You have enough books to put mending on stuff or no? Yeah, I do. Okay, good. Because, yeah, at one point I had gone back and just gotten a shitload of fucking mending. <sighs> nice. The cart's down here, so you just ride it straight down to the mine. Uh, five iron in here, so that's cool. Uh, eight diamond. Nice. Wait, where is this? Uh, down in the mine. Oh, where we were mining last time? Yeah. Um, and I found another uh, six iron, so now we're at like 20 something. I think we can make one block. Or one, um, well, we'll anvil. Need, we'll need oh, 30, 30, right? 31. 
Okay, so we need a couple size. more. Okay. Remember we were doing all the blast mining from up high and we had to clear that big slit, that big, um, table that we were working on? Wait, the table? Remember in the mines of Moria? There was like a, we, we like dug a big hole or a, a, we basically carved out a big block and then blasted our way to, like through it. Are you talking inside the mines? Like how we hollowed yeah. it out? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I, man, that was like... That was like two years ago now. You realize, we, realize we've been playing on this server where... Within a year of hitting our, our record on our other Wait, server. Wait, isn't that where you died last? Weren't you running down there and you, and you ran into lava? I Wait. think you fell into lava down there. That was the last time you died. Wait, when? Where? When you were down in the pit, because remember, you've only died like, what, twice on the... No, you've died a lot more than that. <laughs> yeah. You died? I have died... Uh... Wait, where is it? Oh, god damn it. Number of deaths, 64. What do you have? 68. Oh wow, we're really close. Time played, 43.55 days. <laughs> oh, 21 days. So I've got, i doubled your time. How many, you from, yeah, yeah, yeah. But even 21 days for you, that's like 500 hours. <laughs> that's nothing to sneeze at. I've talked to a thousand villagers and somehow traded with 1300. What? Hold on, wait, I gotta look at some of this. Statistics. Hopper search, notebox played. Uh, let's see. And mob, your chest mob kills, 16,848. An oh, animals, animals bred, 6,339. 400. Wait, animals bred for you? Yeah. Oh my god. I have 6,000! <laughs> Oh god, what does that say about me? Jesus Christ. Fish caught for me, 1,410. Uh, I've talked to 1,347 villagers and traded with 3,077. I've traded with 1,300. Uh, let's see. Any other notice notable ones? Chest open. Black Flag was epic, says Sierra. Uh, I always wanted to play Black Flag. I hope to eventually get to what's that. Your, what's your uh, chest open? 32,424. 14,000. <laughs> oh, nice. Uh, anything else? Only three records played for me. Hmm. I need to play more records. Zero trap chest trigger. Damn. Yeah, same here. So I have no idea where the fuck the TNT is. The TNT? Yeah. Wasn't it in that chest down there? One of those chests down there? No, I found it. Was it one of those I chests? I brought it back up to the... No, no, no. I, I brought it back up to the weapons room. Oh, okay. Goodbye forever, Ender Pearls. I'm throwing all these Ender Pearls into the void. There's too many of them. That's what I do. I don't... I don't say goodbye, I just throw them over. I'm sure there's a quicker way to do this. Yeah, I'm really curious to see, you know, now that the ocean is going to be this really big, vibrant, you know, you know, thriving place, um, what they're going to do next. I'm real curious to see think they're what gonna direction they're going to go. Do something with the sky. They've got to do I, something with the sky. 
I think they're going to improve villagers. Like, they're going to overhaul everything about the villagers. That's true. That would be... I think... I think there's a lot of interesting stuff they could do with villagers. That, that, that does actually seem like a pretty logical next like, step. I mean, it's been... What was the last substantial update to villagers? Was it 1.6 or 1.7? Or was it even 1.5? Like, when they added iron golems and trading and the different professions, that was, like, the last major thing. And that was a very long time ago. Yeah. And Sierra says, I've died less on the server after two years than he has on the nursing home in less than a year. Well, at least I'm not dealing with the lag situation that you're dealing with over there, so... I have a little bit of an unfair advantage. We also uh, play very risky first. Yeah, yeah. Generally. Spawning... the wither in, in the middle of a mesa biome. <laughs> Uh, Brandon wasn't, charging him that after wasn't the most risky first thing ever. Yeah, no, I, I definitely think they broke the mold on that one. Experience! Sweet, sweet experience. Oh god, yeah, sleeping in a bed. We're gonna totally forget to do that so much. We found 1.11, but that might have been village. Wait, village reels? According to some, uh. Whatchamacallit, the little. stupid things that come out of the ground. The stupid. Oh, silverfish. Yeah, I know what you were talking about. When someone talks about stupid things coming out of the ground, silverfish is the only thing that comes to mind. Yeah, fuck all these underpearls. So me and Bridget are re-watching Attack on Titan, because uh, a little while back I got Season 2. Um, you watched Attack on Titan, right? Yeah, good show. Yeah. Yeah, it's really good, man. It's like, w immediately after we get into it, I'm just reminded of how gorgeous the artwork is in that. And it's just it's so fucking dark. I know it has its fair share of critics, but I think it's a genuinely enjoyable thing. Oh, check my statistics. Sleep in a bed one more time. Okay, hold on. Slept in bed? Where is it? Time slept in a bed. Oh god! He's right. I've slept in a bed 68 times. One more. Uh, where does it times? This at the very bottom. Uh, 40. Very good news, Matt. I am at level 40. probably why I'm getting less mob spawns, and I kind of want to uh, be done with this anyway, so I'll like that. Ooh, I found a little hidden passage. A hidden passage? Or a little room we have not explored yet. A cave. Ooh. Cave system. Sounds sexy. In, in the mines. That 
Ooh, found some more caves in Diamond. Ooh, hello. Oh my god, this is so awesome to watch. Oh, that's actually a pretty dangerous cave. And more iron. Yay! I like it because we have a nice view here to sit here and watch the Endermen all spawning in. Okay, uh, I gotta wait before I continue on here. A little dangerous. I can light it up. I should be pretty protected. Oh my god, there's so many down there. I have to kill them all now. I can't... I can't leave when there's so many Endermen. So many Endermen down there. Man, I like a drug. I just can't stop. I have to keep killing Endermen. <laughs> I eat blokes was killed by I was blown up by creeper. Not I eat blokes. And yeah, Sierra, I mean it uh seems like it still works well enough. I mean with them crowding in like that, that's, you know, they seem to just push through and, and make it down the, the poop chute anyways. Anyways, I'm so glad we built this. Ha, huh, got the, uh, got the diamond. Oh, nice vein. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven blocks. Oh my god. Yeah. Today, I have fortune three. It's okay, I have um, um, Silk Touch. Silk touch. Yep. Yes. An emerald. Very nice. Yeah, baby. Two emeralds. What? That was a hell of a good find. Here, back. Gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was holding it, but I'm like, oh my god, there's <laughs> diamond everywhere. Oh my god, that way I pooped my pants. Fucking around with this wither, man. Seriously, fuck the wither. I feel like I always have to look in here. There's stuff that I might want. Even though there usually isn't. Because it's the same shit every time. <laughs> oh, thank you, Sierra. Thank you for uh, the heads up. I'm glad to know. This is the worst staircase I think that has ever been made. <laughs> we should fix this one of these days. Perfect horse riding music. Uh, no, Sierra, we've not killed it yet. That's why we're out leveling up and stuff. We want to make sure we don't just kill this thing, but that we just, like, totally fuck it up.
Uh, I forget, do potions stack in this game? Can I do a strength and a regen potion? think they stack. That's good to know. We're gonna probably be so over prepared for this guy. <laughs> We're just gonna walk in and murder him in two hits. Good horse. Okay, we'll put that back in the chest. I forget, it does it go up to it goes up to looting three, right? Okay, I'm back. Welcome back. I just had to finish up my uh, Chick-fil-A French fries. I need a Chick-fil-A for dinner. Oh my god. Very good. Does looting I forget, do you have looting two or three? I have looting nothing at the moment on this oh, thing. Your sword? Oh, on my sword. Um Three. Three, okay. Oh, the creepers and all kinds of nastiness. Hmm. Well. Alright, well, I'm coming down to join you. I'm up in the fortress. Just clearing out a few things. Should I bring torches? Oof, a lot of guys I'm coming to you. Uh, rub! Rub! I'm oh, shit! That didn't sound like the good kind of oh shit. Okay. <laughs> the fucker right. was chasing me. <laughs> I'm gonna make I'm gonna make some torches real quick because I have a feeling we don't have torches. Uh yeah, that'd be a good idea. I only have three. Right. I feel like there would have been torches on one of their sticks. Yes. Sticks. Yeah, I found a nice big area for us to loot with uh, iron and other goodies. Um, so, so far we have, I have 10 iron on me, um, and like 20 something upstairs, so we have enough to make one anvil. Um, I got 8 diamond blocks, 2 emerald ore blocks, 10 iron ore, um, and 8 diamond, um, from the chest down here, and 11 iron ingots. Wait, 8 diamond yeah. from the chest, and then the diamond blocks you have? Yeah, so eight diamond from the chest and then eight blocks. All right, how many torches do you think we need? Three stacks? Yeah. Okay, bring, bring in three stacks. And I'm going to ride a minecart down there. Are you in the fortress right now? Yep. Okay, here I come. Uh-oh, I think, did I get in the right one? Oh, I got in the right one. Which one did you go to? What? Because I have a minecart here, let me break this. Yeah, you're on the right one. Welcome to the mines of Noria. Alright, you ready? I have presents for you. Come here with your pickaxe. I have, I have some goodies. You ready? Yes.
Oh my god. Sixteen diamond. Plus, I think you picked at least one up. Wait, what the fuck? Hmm. Eighteen diamond. What? What the fuck? What? I put down two emerald blocks and they turn into diamond? Hmm? What the fuck? Did you break em emerald blocks? I broke only diamond. Dude. Did you see that? Did anybody else see that? It I put diamond. down two emerald blocks. It was blocks. diamond all along. No, it was not. It was emerald. I'm telling you. I'm positive. I put down two emerald blocks and they turned into diamond. Well, I never saw any any emerald. I'm tell Dude, no, I'm, I'm just saying. You. I believe you. I'm just telling you. It never showed crazy. up that way to me. It did not Replayed it. I know it didn't. I know it didn't because when I placed them both on top of each other, it instantly turned them into diamond and you broke it. I am not crazy. I promise you. <laughs> okay. Did oh, anybody else it. see that? Please say, please check Twitch. You imagine the whole thing. Whoa, never mind. Here's my Emerald Ore. It just appeared back in my inventory. <laughs> that is so fucking weird. Come here. Here, break this. Okay, hold on. Wow. Ooh, unless, six. unless it glitched back into my inventory. That's so fucking weird. Am I crazy? Did I do something fucking weird and I'm tripping here? I have no idea. Here, I'm putting <sighs> I'm, all this shit in I'm here, though. I'm crazy. Here, here's eight more diamond. Oh my god. That is 26 diamond. Um, here. Take a stack and a half of torches behind you. Okay. How much iron? Uh, here's 11 more, so I have 21 in here and like 20 something upstairs, so another 15. To make two? Yeah. Okay. Alright, where am I? Where am I going? Where do we go? Hang on one second. Okay, sorry about that. It's alright. Okay, down this way. Alright, weapon ready? Wait, what? Sorry, I've <laughs> I've run off into a new direction. <laughs> I'll be right back. I'm coming. The fuck, man? This I, is why we get this I is saw why we something don't have shiny. Nice things. I saw something shiny and dark. No excuses. Alright, down this way. Okay. Okay, so right above you is bad guys, and to your left. Hmm. Here's Smite 5, oh. motherfucker. Here's some emerald. You've got Smite 5 on yours, or what do you have? Yeah, Smite 5. Well, oh, emerald up here, too. So we explored part of this, but not all of this. Interesting. Let me grab this iron. Wait, where are these these stairs from? I don't know. I'm lost. I'm right behind you. Oh shit, here's some more iron down here. Are you near me? Uh, go back to where you were. Oh shit, that's lava. Oh, I see you. So go down these stairs. Cobble 
Crouch down. I got my back. Maybe. <laughs> There's the uh, iron right there above you. Oh shit, here's our tracks over here. Oh, what? <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's why this is somewhat familiar. So that's the uh, item track. Yep. Tiny bit more iron. Okay. Uh, do you know where you're going? Nope. Okay. I figure if we go, go this, this way, way, eventually it'll. I say we go this way. Okay. I'm coming. I see gold in the ceiling. I think this is okay. where we started. Yeah, right this is here. exactly where we started. So. All right, I'm gonna start doing some more blasting. I'm starting another branch. All right, all right, I'm gonna get this. Oh, here's some iron, sweet. Two blocks in front of you. See, the nice thing about mining coal with this pickaxe is that it mostly just repairs itself as I mine and I get the mending. Or, and I get the uh, fortune, so I get tons of coal. Ooh, bedrock. you do your little blasty blasty thingy and don't forget at the end of this whole cavern is is a fresh unexplored underground ravine if you for, have not forgotten i have not forgotten you you mean you have forgotten no by not you mean have yes <laughs> all right man i wish i had a shield right now my world for sure. Famous last words. I'm going to this ravine. Okay, I'll go with you. Well, I mean, you better can keep we building go together. if you want. Yeah, it's better we go together. Too many times we've died from dumb shit we've done by ourselves. Had somebody just been there. Way. I think it's down it's, this hallway. It's down this way. Yeah, to the very end. Man. <laughs> we did a lot of mining down here. Here it is, yep. Look out for the Rava. Okay, here we go. Right over here. Just come on over. Lots of unexplored goodness right in front of us. Do you have any arrows? Yes. Would you like one? I just need one, yes. <laughs> uh, do you have flame on your bow? Because... If you do, we could set up us in TNT and I can, yes, you can shoot it. I do. Okay, just let, just let me know if you want to drop some TNT and start blowing it up with flaming arrows. Oh, I will let you know. I don't know why. Oh, that's right. This is a mine over here. This 
is an underground mine, remember? Oh yeah. That's right, I have Feather Falling 4 on these boots. Yes. No, well, this is less exciting than I had hoped. So, you want to go across to the mine? Um, yeah, if you want to. I mean, it's up to you. Mm hmm. Oh, I don't know, man. Why don't you just go back to TNT? I was hoping there would be more easy to reach um, dark areas there, but we have to cross lava, and I get really nervous around lava. Lava. To my Me too. Um, quite a bit of iron actually, so I think we might actually. Let's see how much do I have. I have thirteen. Thirteen. Yeah, I think we're good. Let's go ahead and go back. That's all we need. That was a good, good, quick run. Yep. I mean, we could have shit a lot of iron. Man, it'd be Not nice if lie, we could find man. one more diamond vein, because that's something we need a lot of, too. Yeah, we do have quite a bit of iron, or diamond. I mean, I don't need any more gear. I have diamond, I have every single piece of uh, diamond gear. You say and, that now, ooh. but <laughs> just wait until <sighs> we fight the wither. I know, but I'm saying, like, for now, we're good. Yeah. We just need a fucking anvil. Not just any anvil, a fucking anvil. We should fight the wither in golden armor. <laughs> hey, do you, <laughs> do you want some experience? Uh, sure. For your pickaxe here, come here. Okay. It's actually a pretty good idea for us to do that. Like, I just pick up the redstone and just bring it over for you to use for mending or... Yeah. Well, I mean, if we both end up having uh, Fortune 3 on our pickaxes, then, you know, we can just do it on the spot. Um, I gotta get rid of um, Silk Touch. That's very problematic. Yeah, yeah. You probably don't want to try to combine those two. So that's 17 emerald we have. Actually, not bad for <laughs> for mining. It's not you can't you don't usually count on getting any emerald from that. Actually, well, I'm gonna bring fortune. a bunch of this cobblestone back up to the surface because there have been a, few, a, a few times that we've tried to get cobblestone when we came back here and there was none. Isn't that kind of sad? It's like we ran out of cobblestone. Yeah, we have a lot at our other base. Like, who the fuck runs out of cobblestone? We do. Yeah, apparently. Right, I'm gonna bring all this shit up. All this ore. Sounds like my wife. <laughs> bring all this shit up? <laughs> yeah. <sighs> so don't forget we have this upstairs room here for, for the fortress that we did. Yep. I know. I just I just walked up there and looked at it. I think we were gonna do continue to do more. Do you want to do some blast mining up here? Like maybe like carve it out some. Mm, not yet. Well, if you want to. <laughs> oh, come here and look. Okay. See what I it looks will, like. I will see what thou hast done. Start digging this way. What do you think? Let's see, can we get diamond here? Uh, we're just above diamond level. But, you know, could be an easy source of iron. 
be kind of cool to hollow this this way out, you know, maybe eventually make the fortress. Um, yeah. Look like a fortress. Yeah, definitely. A fortress that looks like a fortress is always a good thing. Well, I mean, right now it's just kind of like a, you know, a half slab wall with a huge mine. I mean, it's not really anything. Yeah, it's pure crap. It's pure crap, man. Um, I could do some blast mining right here into this wall going this way. We can expand this out right here because we did we have dug up though all those um yeah it'll just merge yeah it'll merge into the tunnel maybe yeah i think it'll merge into some of these tunnels wait i heard a zombie there if i were a taxidermist and your pet donkey just died would you let me stuff your ass <laughs> what <laughs> Sounds like a bad Playboy joke. <laughs> it's a good one though. Oh, I found uh, one passage right here. Yep. Okay, we're not too far off the ground level, so. Well, we're at Y equals 12 um, right here on the level we're at, so. We're at pretty much perfect diamond, diamond mining level. Yeah, I say we start, we hollow this whole area out and then eventually build the wall straight up and then we can just start hollowing out this whole area. Mass strip mining. Oh, nice. Here, hold on. Just hang on one second. Let me just blast this. Watch out. Well, I didn't do as much, uh... Well, it wasn't bad. Alright. We need... Just a little bit more. Hey, <laughs> Dan says, Hey, girl, are you a redstone torch? Because you're extending my piston. <laughs> <laughs> Don't ever again. <laughs> yeah, never again, Dan. <laughs> You're banned from joke telling. <laughs> uh. Hold on one second. Let me just blast this. That's what he said. <laughs> Yes. It works. It works. Alright, I'm going back up to the surface. Fuck this. <laughs> okay. I've got all the iron, too, so I'm... We're gonna make our ambles, and we are gonna finish what we started. Are so, let's on make one anvil here, and one anvil, uh... Are you going back up right now? Where are you yes. going? Oh, I'm going up. I'm, I've taken the minecart, and I'm gone. Okay. Uh, well, it was my mind card to begin with. You, I assume you have yours. Well, I'm trying to catch up. I mean, you just kind of like took off. Dick. Okay. Go, go, gadget mine cart. <laughs> go, go, Sanchez skis. <laughs> okay, we'll leave that there. Um, <laughs> Alright, let me, um... Do we have a... We where's don't where's have the rest of the here. iron? That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do the anvils. You said there's a bunch of other iron up here. I need all yes. iron. Yes, how about you kiss my ass? Okay. And come look at this shit right here. don't want iron, I will just keep it to myself forever. Come look over here, you douche, douchey, douche, mcgee, doucher. Okay. Dude. Alright, well... Come here. I've never been offended. So horribly in my life. Over douchey, right here. Uh, only twelve. I have bad news. We only have fifty-nine iron. 
What? You lied. I thought we would have had 62 iron. <laughs> We're two iron away. <laughs> All right, you run down. All right, I'm on my way. You got the... Wait. Here, I'm going to just make what I can here. One, two, three, four, five, five. Okay, at least make one anvil. There's no such thing as like iron nuggets, is there? Can yes, I make iron? There are iron nuggets, but we can't make them. We can't smelt down iron gear. <laughs> Sarah, whoa, such sass. Sassy pants. Um. Yeah, I'm just gonna put this anvil here. And then. What am I gonna do? I think I just need to enchant more books, honestly. I could put this on breaking two and this looting. No. no, I really do just want to enchant more books. Not found iron. Yes. Good job. Nice. Got protection four. A protection four book, that is. Then a Bane of Arthropods four flame book. Wow, I got eight that. iron out of that. Well, that's all the iron we need. Sweeping edge three, sharpness three. That is some good shit. Okay, now let's just keep going on this. Fire protection three, efficiency three, nice. Not bad. Hey, can I have uh, three diamond? Or do you need it for something? Oh uh, yeah, you can, you can have. I was gonna make uh, another pickaxe that doesn't have silk touch. Oh, there's already two pickaxes made in the tool room. Two diamond ones. Okay. Um... Yes, I would definitely recommend using those because I regretted that they were there and I was hoping we'd find a reason to use them. Efficiency three there. Oh man, I'm gonna do some good merging on this fucking anvil. Efficiency two and efficiency two to make an efficiency three book. Pro Gamer, thank you for one bit. What's up? Oh, thank you for the follow, Pro Gamer. Uh, let's see. Efficiency 3. Efficiency 3. Make that to a 4. Oh, wait a minute. No, that's what I want to do. I've been waiting to upgrade this pickaxe. levels too. There, that'll get me 
to efficiency five. Protection four, I will use that for one of my armors. Uh, do you need efficiency one, power three? Yeah, I don't think you need any of these actually, do you? No, you don't, you don't. Smite four, you have smite five on your sword, right? Yeah. Okay. So I guess I will use both of those. Put these away. I'm gonna go dump the diamond up in the chest up top. Do we have any books, enchanted books here? Oh yes we do. Here I'm about to dump a whole bunch more in here. Oh wait, no, I wanna keep protection. I wanna keep efficiency. Sweeping edge three, sharpness three, efficiency one, power three. Yeah, I wanted to check one of the... Do we have blast protection anywhere? Bummer, there's like no blast protection anywhere. Um, I thought I had a blast protection book. Oh, hand, okay, me, just, some, hand me some of that iron. Here, I have a blast protection for... Here, come here. Yeah, it's in this chest. Okay, I just want to test something. I'm not going to actually use it right now. Oh, no, go ahead and use it. I already have it. So, use it use away. Okay, so what if I did blast protection for... on my armor that's aptly named Great at Deflecting Wither Skulls? No, it won't work because I already have protection on it. No! Wait a minute, we have chess piece is here on iron stands. Yes. Yeah, that would be eight. But I'm totally gonna enchant that because I might actually want that instead of the armor I have. Protection 4 would go on the other one. And I have more mending books, so I can totally afford this second set. Alright, sweet. I'm going to be running back to the Enderman farm here in a sec. Are you... Uh... Oh, wait. Where was that iron again? I think I stuck it in a chest. Uh, it's right here in this uh, bottom right corner furnace. Okay, I'll be right there. I'm putting the diamond up here. So we're up to 34 diamond here now. Um, do we have any gold anymore? This was supposed to be gold at one point. I don't know where we keep gold now. I guess I'll just bring it downstairs. Um... Okay, check out this act or this pickaxe. So, what should I put on a pickaxe besides efficiency? So, I have efficiency for mending three, and um, I'm sorry, mending and a run breaking three. You're gonna want to get that efficiency four up to efficiency five, and then you're gonna right. want fortune three. So, you'll want the enchants I have on mine, fortune three. which okay. is yeah, fortune three, mending, on breaking three, and efficiency five. That's I think is as good as you can get on those. All that bottom right furnace. What does punch do? It knocks them back, right? Yes. All right, good. I have an an anvil crafted for the end. So yeah, I think I have what I want, and I'm gonna run down there. Do we still have a bunch of books down there? I might actually grab more books from the, um... Here, here's 13. 
I might even still grab more than that from the uh, the library and the and the stronghold. There's so many goddamn books we can get from there. Oh, and for that matter, I'm gonna grab a mending book if I'm gonna be doing this enchanting over there. Do you need any mending books? Actually, this is the um, last one. You could, I should put mending on all my gear, yeah. Yeah, I do. Um, um, yeah, actually, I could use a mending book. Well, we're going to need to go and get more because I've got the last one. Um, I think you had grabbed one or two that was in here already. Yeah, I did. Okay, good, good, yeah. So you keep those. And use them. Hey, check out, my, uh, check out my axe. Okay. Dick pick. Nice. Very appropriate. Uh, all right, are we ready? Ready to go? Yeah. Let's go to the. Let's ride off horses. I'm gonna fly. Fuck all right, that. I'm riding my horse. Your horse. My horse. I like having an excuse for it. Uh, see, that's. Sometimes I'm a little sad that the Elytra exists because I miss right, having a reason to ride my fucking horse. Now it's just Fuck like, that. Why would it ride Yay, a horse? progression. Fly everywhere. Yay, capitalism. Can't even eat our horses. The only thing we can do is ride them. Fuck you, hillbilly. I am gone. Oh, I, thought, I thought you were going to say, fuck you, hillbilly. I'm going to eat my horse. power, but I have horsepower. Yeah, that's not really how that should be used. <laughs> this horse has a lot of torque. <laughs> has a turbo. Just blow, blow yeah. up the gas. Yep, he has a turbo ball and turbo balls engine. V A W L S. Alright, fuck these doors, they're coming down. My, I am sick of this shit. Thank you. My horse I am has done. a hemi. And by, I am and by hemi, done. I of course mean horse hemorrhoid. Doors are no more. Oh shit, I forgot to go with pumpkin. That's okay. Just don't look. I never wear a pumpkin. I hate pumpkins. Never use protection? Nope. Never. Bear head. What's that? It has a lot of talk. So, how did you fuck up this, like, bridge thing that we built going down, and why can't it be fixed? Wait, what are you talking about? The, the um, the, um, ladder going down to the ender ender. How come there's it's, like, nothing, a sheer drop off? There's nothing broken? Oh, I don't understand. What's the problem? You don't want anything, like, in front of us to keep us from, like, falling to our deaths? No, I want to be able to see the Enderman as we go down. I mean, if you want to replace it with glass, be my guest. Okay, I see. You just want to be able to see the Enderman. Gotcha. Yeah. I like to be able to see my prey before I... <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, I'm getting so many books. There's 16 bookshelves over here. Uh, I have over two stacks of books. I'm good, thank you. Got 
Actually, I'm gonna put these iron doors in this chest. Let's fuck these iron doors. All right, I'm going out to the Ender Ender. I've got an anvil and all kinds of good shit with me. Level 15, was it level seven? Sweet. Should start to get more efficient as I get closer. pissed off. Alright, here we go. Anvil. Anvil, motherfucker. Alright, and lots of books. Alright, yeah, we've got a whole one-stop shop for getting our shit together here. What's up, Deathy Claws? Deathy Claws, one, two, three, five. Okay, I, uh, Windows update just flashed on my screen and minimized my game. No. I gotta leech some of this experience. I got these books just burning a hole in my pocket. Oh, nice, you got a lot of books. Oh, I have the important ones on me. <laughs> okay. Pearl. Pearl necklace proof chest. <laughs> do protection for um, everything else. So 
So yeah, let's put this old chest piece in here. Great at deflecting wither skulls. You're actually not so great. Pearl necklace proof chest is way better. Oh, what's up, Louie? How are you tonight? Efficiency four. All right, we want protection. First. Do you have a protection three book? I don't. I don't have. I think we might have some back at the other base. Let me see what we have here. Yeah, no protection here. I just have the one protection four book that's for me. Enough. Six should be enough. Yeah, that was the book I gave you. Protection four? Yeah. No, no I give you flash protection four. Yeah. There we go. I've got a blast protection four from my pearl necklace to the chest. Protection four from my Urkel pants. Protection four from my Wither Skull Crushing Boots. And oh, I'm still on protection two for my penis helmet. So I need protection four for one more thing. Yeah, I need one more protection book. Like a protection three, and I'll be good. Let's go to the nether, or the yeah, other nether and kill the wither. Let's kill that fucker. Let's, let's be vindicated and move on. Yes. <laughs> this is gonna be so overkill, I hope. So overkill. I could also probably put thorns on this chest just to, like, really fuck shit up. Oh, that's a good idea. I didn't think about thorns. I'm gonna do that. I have a villager back at uh, the base that shall not be named that sells Thorns 3 book. Okay, cool. What's the fastest entrance to the Wither? Would it be from here? Yeah. Fastest way to get to the Wither? Okay. Yeah, the best way. Let's just go from here. We're Let's gonna just screw the thorns and go after the wither. Okay. Well, I'm gonna need a few more levels. I wanna level up one more time here. What are you at right now? 29. Oh, sweet. I'm gonna make a couple more books. See if I can't get protection. Yeah. And then yeah, I'm gonna make sure before we fight the wither, I'm gonna put my pickaxe and all that shit away. Just bring a shitty pickaxe. So that way if I do die somehow. I, I don't see it happening, man. I think we're gonna fuck this shit up. Oh, we should get a little more extra iron just so we can have some milk, because the milk really helps. Do you want to smite four? Uh no. No, I'm good. I have smite five. Fire protection. I can do protection two if that'll help you get protection three. Um. Yeah, I mean, well, because what the best way to do it is to take multiple protection two books, merge it into a protection three book, and then once the book is to the level you need it, then merge it onto your item. So I think we have another protection two book somewhere. Oh, here's a protection three. Nice. Oh, even better. I can get back up to level 30. Protection four is the highest, right? Yeah. Efficiency 5, the Axe of Destiny, and I'm back down to level 0, but I have some fucking badass tools. 
And yeah, I think at this point I just need to gain levels so that I can make a bunch more books. And I think all I need would just be a little more unbreaking. Unbreaking would be like one of the best things right now because I need it for a few items. Um, even though I have mending, I still want unbreaking. And then, yeah, I need this penis helmet to go from protection two to protection four. And then I think that respiration two can go to three. That would be good. I don't remember if Depth Strider, does that go up to three? Well, that's my question. Do Respiration and Depth Strider both go to three, or do they stop at two? My question is, I have a um, Troll 1 Enchant. I put it in the Enchanting table, right? Wait, if you do what? A tool you want to enchant? Yeah. Only if you want to enchant it directly. Yeah, but for whatever reason, this uh, um, is not showing up as an as enchantable. Does it have enchants on it? No. And you put... Wait, so you got Lapis Lazuli in one slot, and what kind of tool is it? A hoe. Can you enchant a hoe? What, what were you trying to give it? I don't know anything. with like a break in it. Well you can't enchant it directly. So it looks like anyway. That like might be know. true, you might have to do it through a book on an anvil. these ender pearls again. A nice thorn. Wait, what'd you get? Thorns. On a book? Yeah. A level, which level? One. Better than zero. Oh, and if we have enough gold, I totally want to make a couple golden apples, too. <laughs> this is just overkill the fuck out of this thing. Oh, and you know what? <laughs> I think back at our other base, I have a totem of undying in my chest. I should totally hold that in my offhand so that we have, like, about a billion different <laughs> recourse options. Yeah, my totem's up there. Is up where in the in the Nether? Yeah. Yeah, one of my totems is there, but we we had actually gotten three, so there was one other uh, that I have. Do you need unbreaking three at all? Yes, I need unbreaking three. Okay, let me let me get it. I can, I can do it real quick. Let me get five more levels. Sweet. And then let's go kill the wither. Very close. 
Well, I'm gonna make a quick flight back to our other base just to get um, that totem and some thorns books. Okay. Um, well, let me finish this up real quick to give you your shit. Okay. Yeah, I want to do a few more levels here too. Actually, uh, let me step away for just a brief minute and go to the bathroom and get some more water while you kill these dudes. And no. Then... Don't, don't fucking me that way. Oh, God. Make a gold farm? I know. Um, we could make a gold farm, but right now, it's just an enderman farm. chance to piece my gear for 20 levels so I had to build back up. I'm back to 20 though. It's, an, it's really cool how fast that happens. Let me see here. Yeah, it's really nice that we don't need to bother with shield, having a shield for the wither. so satisfying <laughs> killing them when there's like you know a few dozen of them okay, let's go up here and let's look at things from this direction Ooh, that, ooh, damn, that was a lot just now. Did you just kill a whole bunch of them? 
Yeah, why? Because I just saw a surge of them spawn. On the, I'm, I'm up top, just watching the platform. Oh, uh, here, I'll kill a bunch and watch them, watch them spawn here. There we go. I just killed a bunch. No, didn't do it that time. Hmm. I'm at 26 levels. Nice. Ooh, that was a lot that time. I guess it just is random each time. Sometimes when a spawn tick happens, it spawns a bunch of them, and sometimes only a few. It's amazing to see how effective it works, though. Like, they spawn in, and for the most part, they pretty much immediately aggro on that Endermite, and then... There's a little bit of cloggage because a few, you know, they're kind of just stuck on the edge, but enough spawn that, you know, they're constantly, like, dripping through. It's definitely slowed down. Well, there we go. Hold on. Now you're about to get a few. Come on, why are so many of you stuck? There we go, here we go. The dam has to burst soon. This is mesmerizing, I can't, I can't take my eyes off the screen. Oh, come on guys, you can make it, yes. Oh. But seriously, the way they're stacked up, it, it looks like a dam about to burst. They're all just vibrating. <laughs> like crazy. Just like, <laughs> we really want that Endermite. <laughs> it's like, God, can't you guys navigate a one block wide corridor? Fucking idiots. Can we make it any wider? Uh, no. No, this is this is kind of how it needs to be. I mean, it's fine. I think overall we're getting enough effectiveness out of it that it's. it's good. Yeah, we got a. So I'm at 29, almost level 30, but we gotta hurry because I can't be up much later. Okay. base to get the totem. Yeah, sure. Do you want them breaking three? Yes. Both get right behind you. Try to get some buckets too, so we <clears throat> we can do buckets. Some... Be sure to bring some um, <clears throat> books to trade with the uh, villager. Yeah, I think I have a bunch already over there, so I think we'll be good. Man, I wanted to 
get to level 30, but I don't know if I have the patience. Oh, it's really testing me. Yeah, I really wanted to up the protection just a little more on that helmet. Oh, when you get back, can you check to see if we have any books with protection in chance? Yep. Can't remember. I'm back. I'm gonna go look. That's a blockage. Oh, Rasinka, hello. Hey, Rasinka. What's up, Koala Kicker? How are you? Where would the book be? Uh, the changing room? Yeah. Yeah, if, if we have any protection books, they'd be in there. Looting two. And breaking two. Can we sell ender pearls to clerics or anything? I don't know. What's the fastest way to get back to our other base? Flying. Skyline. It's only a couple maps away. Do you want to fly together? Sure. Okay. Then we'll finish our prep there, and then we will immediately go and fight the other. Almost to level 30. I at least want to get there before. So wait, there's Thorns 1 here. Yeah, I don't think we need Thorns 1. Wait, how? Wait, Protection 2? What? Where the fuck did this come from? Did you put that in there? Maybe, probably. <laughs> That's one of the things I needed! Oh god, no, but it's enchantment cost 34. Okay, I have got to get that to Protection 3 before I get there. No, I actually I have to get that way up to four. Fuck. I feel like I've looked at these a hundred times, but I always see something new. Okay. Brew some awkward potions real quick. Sure. The brewing room is uh, adjacent to the kitchen. So, uh, water bottles with uh, nether wart. And then from there, we'll do some regen potions. I have two, two instant health, two splash potions of healing in my ender chest. Just nether wart cooked into a water bottle on the brewing stand with uh, blaze power for the fuel. There we go, level 30. Fuck yeah. Um, 
So I'll just use whatever remaining... <clears throat> these 30 levels I'll use uh, to apply thorns to my armor, and then if we have any more on breaking or protection at our other base, we'll see if I can do that there. Okay, so what do we need to make um, some, like, uh, potions? Because we have a lot of ingredients here. Uh, okay, so you have the awkward potions made? Yep. So with the awkward potions in there, add... Um, I think a ghast tier gets us um, regen potion. So if you want to see how many ghast tiers we have and... Add one of those. Make sure there's three bottles in so we get the full three potions out of it. We have six gas tiers. All right. And then once we add that, then I think we're going to want to add... Uh, what? Either glowstone to make it more powerful or redstone to make the duration longer. Probably more powerful. We have to do those modifiers. Yeah, I would I would agree. I think this is going to be a short-term battle. We just need that that quick boost. Um, and the other one we would need are potions of healing, which we need glistering melon for that, which is uh, melon and uh, gold nugget. Okay, how many potions of regen? Uh. How about six? Yeah, six sounds <laughs> plenty good. Oh my god, not having these doors is amazing! Okay, um, six potions of regen. What gets us health? Wait, and are you adding glowstone to it to make it more powerful? I will do that now. Yes, do that now. You bastard. Um... And then, yeah, Glistering Melon, you'll need Melon, which I think we have in one of the chests there, do we? Melon? Yeah. And we also have uh, Gold Nuggets. Sweet. So we should be able to make Glistering Melon. All right, I'm writing my full spec. <sighs> oh yeah, we might need to make a few more rockets. I have some 29 gunpowder, so we can make it to you. Okay. How do you make a, um, wait. Okay, how do you make a golden, uh, melon? Is it, uh, in a crafting table you do a melon with a gold nugget? Well, if it is, then I need more gold. One melon to one gold nugget? No, that no. doesn't work. Does it have to be a melon no, I think surrounded, it's surrounded in gold it. nuggets? Yeah, I think so. Really? Um, oh, man. I thought you only had to do that with the golden carrots. I'll try it with the crafting table.
No. So, surrounded, huh? Yep. Motherfucker. Where would gold be? Uh, down here. We have 11 gold. So... Oh, you know what? Hold on, let me smelt down some iron. Or some, some armor. We have tons of armor. Alright, I'm here. Um... This water bucket can become a milk bucket. With a little bit of effort. And our powers combined. This water bucket can be a milk bucket. I'm gonna go milk a, milk a cow. Actually, you know what? No, I'm gonna wait till I have more buckets to milk those cows. Um, where are you at? Uh, potion room. Okay, I'm going. All right, closer to melon for rockets. Okay, potion room. I will be there in just a second. I'm gonna take one last look at all of these. Yeah, yeah, we're good. Alright. I this chest up here. Hereby bestow the on you. The potion chest? Yep. Wait, am I putting the gold nuggets in there? No, I, it's already taken care of. I just... Well, oh, if you have more gold nuggets, I can make another... I can make three more um, instant health potions. How many have you made so far? Just three? Yeah. Yeah, here, I'll make some more blistering melon. Blistering melon. Why do you cost so much to make? There we go, I'm making some awkward potions. Okay, here, two more glistering melon. This will make six more. Oh, just... Okay. All right, and I'll put this melon back here. We'll put this gold here. Take these eight nuggets. Uh, and then you say, well, do I want to? No, we need to save some of this gunpowder. I'm going to take half of this gunpowder. Here, I have 29. Here, take this. Gladly. Here. How many? Ro you need rockets too, right? I have 49. I mean, I'll take some more. Here. Take this many more. There we go. Got that taken care of. Uh, and then, so I'm gonna add. I'm gonna add a uh, gunpowder to. Yes. Oh wait, no. First, we want to add glowstone to make them instant health two potions. Okay. Add glowstone. And then I'm gonna add gunpowder to make them splash potions. I like brewing. <laughs> it's kind of a cool activity. And there's another one back here. If we have more here. Go ahead and throw some um, gunpowder in this one to make it splash. Wait, you wanna. Yeah. Glowstone. Um. Gunpowder on the one on the right and the one on the left. Those are mundane potions. Oh god damn it! Why the fuck do we have mundane potions in here? They look the same as water bottles. I should have read the name. Here, give me the gunpowder so I can uh, make these splash. I got it. God damn it! You come in and fuck with my shit. Oh man. <laughs> There's too many cooks in this kitchen. There's one cook and it's me. Well, I'm just going to be a shadow cook in the corner over here that you're going to have to learn to deal with. There's only one Walter White, bitch. Alright, awkward potions. Do we. Wait, was that all the glistering melon? Yeah. Um. 
Um, then let me do strength potions. <laughs> We're gonna go can, all can out. Can we just like, go kill him? <laughs> no, that would be too easy. Strength potion. But we're practically there. See, they're really getting into bed. Okay. Should we just not even fly back to our other base and just do it? Yes. Alright, we will do that. For your sake. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, we should be fine. We're not going to have golden apples or milk. No, yeah, let's go to the top and fly back. You do want to fly back? Yeah. Okay. I think we can do it pretty quickly. Uh, wait, where's an ender chest? Sky Island. Okay. I need my wings and then I'll launch. Okay. Flying Pima. Put these in here. Put these in here. Put that in there. Okay. Here I come. That's what she said. Oh, I was waiting for it. Damn it. It wouldn't work. Alright, so the way back is this way. Up top here. You ready? <laughs> oh. oh my god, I'm not wearing my wings. <laughs> okay, <laughs> go. Oh, I'm such an idiot. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna literally go straight south and then just a little bit to the left. It's gonna list a little bit to the left. And Are you sure it's not the other way? I'm absolutely sure. I've done this trip a few times now. 100% sure. That would never lead us astray. Okay. We will intersect the glass tunnel after we pass about uh, two and a half maps worth. Which is nothing because if you think about the flight to the <laughs> to the mansion. <laughs> That's like 12 maps. <laughs> uh, I hate that. It was totally worth it. Oh, it was, yeah. Yeah, it was a cool thing. Just kicked a cord to your Xbox and a spark burned your carpet? That that's terrifying. Koala kicker. So yeah, eventually we're gonna hit an ocean. Oh forest fire. Yay. I love forest fires in Minecraft. Watch out for these mountains. And a little ways after this ocean will be our glass tunnel. I really like the. Let's uh, see, in the area we haven't there. explored yet is the area between here and the ocean monument. Um, there's yeah, there's some like diagonal from here to the ocean monument, yeah, because the ocean monument is a lot further to our left and a little further south from us. Okay, so we're gonna keep going. It's a big ocean.
Okay, look for it. There it is. So we're gonna turn left. We're gonna fly a little diagonal here. And... There it is. We follow this the rest of the way. See, isn't that awesome? <laughs> Fucking flying blind for a couple of maps. I enjoy the adrenaline rush from that crazy ballsy risk that we just took. That wasn't really a risk at all. Um, where did you go? I am to our base. Okay, why... Are you following okay. the glass tunnel? Uh, apparently I lost you. Are you on the glass tunnel? Nope. Did you ever see it? Nope. What? Okay. What's your X, Y, Z? Man. I mean, if you just keep going south, you're going to hit our base. <laughs> you should have said something a lot sooner. I thought you were right behind me, bro. What's your what's your XYZ? Hit what hit F3. I'm back at the base. Oh my god, you motherfucker. <laughs> okay. You had me all worried. No, I was lost, but I just got back. Okay. Alright, so you want me to go up and do some trading with that villager? Sure. Sorry, I'm just flying back for a second time. <laughs> I was flying back to try to find you. Come on, base, load in, load in, oh my god! There we go, this is where we want to be. My pyramid top village. I love flying up here, it looks so cool. Are you getting thorns? No. I don't have any emerald. Oh, emerald's over here. No, 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 perfect. Here. Emerald! <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. Okay, go do it. Do it right, just do it. Wait, Can I have one? some emeralds? Uh, I left the rest in the chest for you to grab whatever you needed. Oh. oh I'm sorry. Yes, Mrs. Mennington. Does Mrs. Mennington have thorns? That's respiration three. Mending. Projectile protection. Okay, where's... Where's the other one? Mrs. Sweepington. Can I get some, um, books from you? Sweeping edge three? No, is it not here? Maybe it's at the other base. Uh, get what? Books. Oh, yes, here. That's good. Yeah, get whatever you need. There's, uh... I'm trying to think if Sweepington had anything else you would want. No, just sweeping. And then, yeah, this one had... Is that again? Luck of the Sea 1. Punch to fortune one, yeah. Oh, this is garbage. There's another librarian somewhere in the village that I feel like has what I'm looking for. Any secret secret librarians in here? I don't think so. Librarians in here? Are there any librarians? Her. I think this guy is not a librarian. Okay, do we have an anvil here or no? Um. I don't know. I think we do in one of the villager houses. 
Do you know which one? Mm, try the toolsmith's house. If I were me, I would have placed it in here. But if I wasn't me, who knows? Damn, tough break. Maybe, I got all those books and I can't even do anything. Maybe I didn't make one. I mean, we should have one in... Oh, wait. I don't think I would have put it in here. Would I have? Here, I'll help you search through the houses because I feel like I did put one somewhere. I put brewing stands in this house. I have a thing I feather falling because I do not have my elytra on. <laughs> did you jump off the pyramid? Yeah. <laughs> My God! What? You survived? survived. You yeah. fucking survived! <laughs> oh my God! Wow! Feather falling is the real deal. Uh, okay. Well, oh, this was a. Here, there's an anvil here at our base. Okay. I don't know what I'm trying to even get. Anyways, I don't. The villagers are useless for what I wanted them for, which was thorns. Oh well, fuck thorns. Um, let's just get some milk buckets, golden apples, and my totem of undying. Totem of Undying. Offhand. Well, the anvil broke. Did it now? Hmm. We only have two iron here. Well, we're going to be going back to our other base, anyways. Um, to go through the uh, nether. I can make. Lots of golden apples. Oh my god. Here, I'll give you two golden apples, and then I'm gonna get some milk, and we'll be good to go back. Did you get the potions? What potions? All the healing potions. The ones that we made back at the other base? Yeah. No, they're at the other base. We're gonna be going back there though. Okay. Well, um, Here, gold did apples. You get Those are at the other base too. Uh, okay. We kind of had things across both bases here. Um, but yeah, now we have golden apples. We have. Uh, oh, I needed to check the books here too, and then we needed buckets for milk. So that was the other thing I was getting. Okay, I'm gonna go to my base and get some rockets and I'll be standing by. Okay. Uh, four buckets. That'll do. Oh, can I do a flyby milking? Oh my god, I did a flyby milking. I flew by the cows and I milked them while I was in midair. That was amazing. Uh, wait, was there anything else I was doing? I have a potion of instant healing here in my chest. Two of them. Okay, awesome. Instant health too. Uh, if you want to bring those... I think we have enough of those. I think I think everything we made back at the other base is good. Maybe super edge, power, back, back. 
god, there's so many things here. I have a Protection 3 book here if you need it. Uh, I do, because I just found another Protection 3 book. So if I can combine those two, then I'm covered. Silk Touch, Fortune 3, Unbreaking 3. You need any of those? Silk Touch, Fortune 3, Unbreaking 3. I do need the Unbreaking 3. Oh shit, see, this is why we came here. This is good Protection shit. 3, you said you needed? Yes. Power 3, Aspect 1, Aqua Affinity. Okay. I'm at my base waiting for you. Okay. Oh, Thorns 3. There it is. I already had a book here. That's why I, I knew there was a Thorns book somewhere here. Just to you Thorns for protection. Uh, hold on one sec. Efficiency 3, power 3, blast protection 2. Okay, I am good. Let me put this gold back, and I am flying to you. Yeah, my gear is fucking ridiculous. Oh yeah, this is gonna be very, very cool. All right. Ready for the flight back? Yep. Do you need rockets? Nope. I got a full stack right here. And I have my totem of undying on me. Okay, lead the way. Alright, uh, straight north from right here. No turning at all. We should... Oh, oh hang on. Actually... I do not have my helitron. Oh, shit. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Coming back. Actually, no, hey, not, man, not fully straight. Quite a bit. We go straight north to the... Um, the glass tunnel and then we turn left and we follow the glass tunnel to its end and then go straight north from there and it and we run directly into our highway our skyway all right okay, hopefully yeah we can get back and get going all right yeah so just right goes straight you. north until we hit our uh, our tunnel and then follow the tunnel to the left So goddamn prepared for this. I have a fucking totem of undying in my hand. And yeah, he's gonna be immune to arrows because he's already low enough health that he's at that stage. Oh, I'm fine with that. Yeah, so we just need to r literally rush him and start hacking away. Okay, where be? I guess I just wait. Uh-oh, we missed it. Go this way. You follow you still got me? Yep. Alright, this is it right here. Okay, now we turn right and we're gonna go straight north and don't go any further left or right. This is basically how we go through the nether right here and we take a straight path to our other base. It's this is like that spot in the overworld where now we get a straight path, straight shot north to our base. Uh, and what's up, Andrew 53 Hello, and welcome back, Xbox Core Kicker. <laughs> no, I think we just passed an ocean monument. I heard... Can you guardians. see me? Yeah, I'm right behind you. I just passed you. I love the span of ocean here. This is really awesome. And then a random little savanna island. I'll be giving you two uh, buckets of milk. Oh, 
We should tackle this sand monument or the sand um, desert. I think that is the desert that we've started doing, that we've gotten to oh, from okay. the ocean monument. Pretty sure that's the same desert. Not 100% oh. sure. Okay. Wow, the ocean monument's that close to our other base? Well, it's a, it's a, like a map and a half over. It's kind of... Not quite... It's almost halfway in between. See one of our old bases there on the right? Yep. That's, I, I, I enjoy seeing shit that we built while exploring like two fucking years ago. There's another one up here too, a cobblestone one. Somewhere. Alright, we are going to be to the Skyway any second now. After this one. There's little, the little yeah. hut. Yeah, after this one, it's going to be right up ahead. There it is. See that? Keep going straight. Yep, just follow the skyway now. And we're back. Just like that. I feel like this is a runway. <laughs> oh. I'm scared that I'm going to smash into that glass. Oh, well, we have a runway over here. Alright. Let us get the potions and do this last bit of enchanting. Three thorns, three. So you want me? You said you wanted the thorns, right? Yes, please. Okay. And you got the potions? Uh, come grab yours. Okay. The rest are yours. Slash potion of healing. Oh, thanks for the follow, cord kicker. Regeneration, I will take. Uh, what about the strength ones? Are those still? Oh yeah. Uh, you want to throw me one? One what? A strength. I don't have... I was asking if you had the strength potions. I didn't make any. Uh, they were all on the thing back here. Oh, wait. I put them in the ender chest. Ha 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 about that. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh here. Take your milk. Yeah. Take your fucking milk. Put the, <laughs> put the lotion in the fucking basket. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. Put the lotion on its skin or it gets some hose again. Take, take the milk. Take the milk. Take the fucking milk. Alright. Uh, right, Anvil. Yeah. Uh, here, you want thorns? Thorny thorns? Yes. Come take. And give me that Protection 3 book. There's thorns. Okay. I'll take Protection 3. Alright. And then Unbreaking 3 if you have it too. Ah, oh, 15. How many levels do you have? I have 30. Oh, here. You can show my chest, too. Protection 3. Sure. And breaking 3, protection 3. And what am I enchanting for you? Uh, thorns and chest plays. Uh, where's your chest? Right here, baby. Oh. Uh... There's the words. Plate four. It will now have protection yep. four on breaking three, mending, and thorns three. Here you go. It's right there. A pretty badass chest piece. All right. It sure is. All right. Protection three. Protection three. And I'm gonna go drop this chest piece off in the end chest. Oh my god, it... 38! <laughs> That's so much! 38 levels is what I need? Penis helmet? <laughs> for my penis helmet? <laughs> oh well, at least I've got the protection for now. So I have, a, I have a diamond helmet that I need to name. It's in Breaking 3, Blast Protection 4, Aqua Affinity, Mending, and Respiration 3. And it's a helmet? Yeah. 
Um, I don't know. Call it. Uh, <laughs> I can't think of anything. That's okay. All right, you ready to go? Uh, yeah, because I took penis helmet, and that's all that comes to mind. <laughs> Uh, just about, just about. Protection for amending. We're gonna do this real quick and unbreaking. Urkel pants officially have unbreaking on them. Uh, take your Elytra off <laughs> if you didn't already. Um, and oh, I'm going to the end ender chest real quick to. Uh, actually, yeah, I'm gonna put all this stuff in the ender chest, and then we're gonna go. Okay, I'll be waiting down into another portal. Okay, you're already... You sh took off your good tools and shit? Yep. Okay. Alright, the moment of truth. So, we rush in there, we chug our potions of strength, which I'm getting right now. Um... We chug our potion of regeneration and then we get ready to fucking roll that, that that no point in any of that nonsense potion of strength potion of regeneration okay i'm ready I have my hot bar ready to go, so we are gonna. Like, if you're ready, as soon as we run through, let's um, what's that? Take that door on the left instead of going through the tunnel and coming up from the Nether Fortress. Holy for you. Let's go through that ridge, or go over that ridge that that lands us on top of the Nether Fortress. Okay, so the golden apple is for what now? Just as soon as you get the wither effect. Like, as soon as he hits you with a skull, uh, chug one of those apples. And right before we're about to run up to him, let's chug a potion of strength. Do you have a strength? Oh, uh, yeah, potion of strength. There you go. So I've got on my hot bar potion of strength, potion of regen, uh, two golden apples, two milks, two splash potions of healing, and then my sword and my bow. Yep, that's what I have. All right. Oh, and hold on. Food. <laughs> the food is important. Okay, ready? Ready? Let's do this. Oh shit. Okay, this way. Damn it, my hands are already shaking. Alright, equip your potion of strength. And as soon as we get to this ridge here, I say we chug it. I took no damage from falling. Yeah, same here. Alright, uh, or maybe as soon as we start climbing these hill hills. This stair here, because he's up, he's up at the top of that fucking stair. Oh god, no, he's back to half health. God damn it. Oh my god, I'm stuck. Alright, tell me when to chug. Alright, are we up? I'm up. Okay, chug. Are we going up the stairs together? Yeah, go. Okay. Ain't no fucking around. Go, go, go. All in. Point man! Got him. Yes! I didn't have to use anything! Oh! Get the gear, get the gear, get the gear, get the gear. Where is it, where is it? I got my totem of undying. Oh, did you? Yeah. Alright, oh my god, we got him so quick! <laughs> is there anything else? I think there's more shit back here, hold on. Oh god, I don't have a pickaxe. Um, neither do I. Alright, I'm just going to... I got the nether star too, yes. Okay, there's some shit that should be back here.
I don't know, maybe it despawned. I mean, I did live okay? for a little while and it took us some time to get back here. What's that? It sounds like your adrenaline's like pumping. <sighs> Dude, my <laughs> fucking heart is beating through my chest. <laughs> he went down so fast. I never got yeah. a single skull thrown at me. <laughs> I, I, was, I was not even stressing. I was taking like all the damage and my health was at full the entire time. Oh my god. That's In so fact, awesome. it was really strange. I gained a heart. <laughs> Did you eat an apple? Yeah, oh, that's I why. ate two apples. You ate two? Yeah. Oh, okay, well, you know, hey, you're alive. I didn't lose a single heart that entire fight. Oh my god. Woo! <laughs> I Thank you, Solomon. Protection. Thank you, Rasinka. Oh my god. I have blast protection four on my helmet and my boots and protection four on my chest and, and legs. So, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> oh, I want to go craft another one now. <laughs> but no, I I think we got some important shit back. So what did you get back? I got a whole um, lot It looks of like I got my totem of dying. It looks like I got a... Um, uh, looks like I got Vegemite Spreader. Oh, really? Yeah. Yes. Any other armor, weapons, anything? No. Uh, looks like a bow. Kevin Costner's Redemption. <gasps> no! Really? <laughs> yes! yes. Yeah. Oh my god, Kevin Costner's Redemption! And I got some Diamond Boots, Protection 3, Mending, Unbreaking 3. Uh, this is a terrible place <laughs> out in the open where a ghast could just start shooting me. But hey, I have blast protection. Oh, and the three wither skulls were in here. Oh my god, I'm putting those in the ender chest. Wait. There we go. And the nether star. These diamond boots. Oh wait, I got the other totem of undying. We have all three totems of undying again. Nice. Oh my god, here, the best here, shit. Here, here get the... Uh... Get Vegemite Spreader and Kevin Costner's Redemption back to its owner. Oh my god, this is a glorious night. I got a shield out of it, so I don't know whose it is, but I'm taking it. Which, is it one of our design shields? or? Yeah. Oh, awesome, yes. Because it's too hard to copy that fucking pattern. Yeah, I know. So just having one shield. We have a master. We have a master pattern at the, um, at the Sky Island. Do we? It's uh, on awesome. the castle, yeah. I kept Man. it there for... I didn't need any milk. <laughs> I had one bucket, and that's when I, that's I, when you know, the wither effect went away, and I realized I was at full fucking health. Well, I shot him with one arrow, and you must have hit him at the same time, because he <laughs> took, like, I don't know, like an eighth of his entire health bar went with one, what seemed like one hit, and then that had dropped him back down to... Uh, you know, where we needed to hit him with the sword. But yeah, I got the nether star in the... Do you want to go kill another one real quick? Uh, we have our totems of undying. We can just throw that in our, in our hand. I mean, we have all the shit. Not right here. <laughs> no, go upstairs. Just do it again. No, no, not in the nether. If we do it, we would do it back at Sky Island down in the mines. Why? Let's just go do it. No, I want to quit while we're ahead. I've learned my lesson. Uh. Because uh, seriously, the lava, like the lava potions. risk, the lava risk is real, dude. I have fire protection. I don't. Ugh. I'm too scared. Besides, you need Ugh. to go to bed, sleepyhead. Yeah, <laughs> uh, you gonna pull that card on me? Seriously? Yep, yep. Screw you. Yep, that's right. Unless you want to just right. go spawn him in, down in the mine, it would only take us a second to get back there. All right, go, 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 go. Let's Are we do doing it. it? All right. Yes, go. Ahead. No, in the mine Move. down here? Yes. Yeah, yep, yes. yep, yep, yep. Alright, yep. oh, oh my god. What if we regret this horribly? There's then we go back to the end. Yeah, that's true. Um my recommendation, Kevin Costner's uh, redemption has had a second chance. Um No, I'm sorry. I'm using my fuck the wither bow because <laughs> seriously, my Oh, and seriously, fuck the wither. Right as I said that, I switched to my sword, which is called, seriously, fuck the wither. <laughs> so yeah, my bow is fuck the wither, my sword is seriously, fuck the wither. Oh my god, ah, I can't climb up the slab stairs of death. 
I hate this. <laughs> I've made an impassable. You've obviously I got over. made up. Where? Where can I climb up? Alright, it's gotta be over here. And I don't have a um, I'm pickaxe. glad you got some of your shit back and we got both totems of undying, which is awesome. Made it. I know. So yeah, three totems of undying. Wait, are you in the nether still? Yeah, there's a wither. Or a ghast. There was. Might as well collect the tier. Let's get his tier. Oh man. Oh, he didn't drop one. Boo. Alright. I'm going through. Back to. Our. Uh... Were we spawning this thing, Moria? Yes. So, Sky Island. Yep, I'm already here in Sky Island, so just come through the portal. And we're gonna fuck this shit up. I think I have everything I need on me still, so if I go Potion of Strength, Potion of Regeneration, two buckets of milk. Well, we need Soul Sand. Hold on, let's go over here. Um, I need another push of strength if you got one. Do we really not have any fucking soul sand here? Did you check the nether room? Yeah. Uh, I have one more potion of strength for... Uh, well, shit. Can you, uh, actually go make a potion of strength real quick while I handle the soul sand situation? I'll be right back. Sure. Uh, strength requires what? Uh, blaze powder, and then uh, fuck, I need a shovel. Hold on, let me get a shovel. Blaze powder, and then uh, glowstone to make it into two. All right, later, koala kicker. Sorry, I missed that message. I've been like, this has been really intense. Oh my god, why is this taking so long? Just sitting here like, do we seriously not have soul sand anywhere here? There has to be. Um, so blaze powder made them mundane potions. Oh, well you have to start with awkward potions, always. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I just drink the mundane potions. It's okay. <laughs> Doesn't do anything. This makes you feel melancholy. Yeah. Yeah, no effects. Oh, yes, we had soul sand in here. Haha, -ha, I knew it. That was easy. That was very easy. I don't even need to craft a fucking shovel now. Alright, and the best bet will probably be to start hacking... Well, no, actually, we want to stand back <laughs> when he first explodes and maybe just use our bows. I take that all back. Alright, uh, are you already down there? Or uh, no, I'm you're, making, you're making potions. Those potions, okay. Uh, I've got one potion of strength, too, on me. Uh, and I think we both have the regeneration we need, splash potions. Did you... You said you still have a bucket of milk, or no? Yes. Here, take a golden apple. I think one golden apple each should hopefully be enough. Let me add some bl um, glowstone to that to make it stronger. Okay. Potion oh, strength and you know too. what? Let's go sleep in our beds over here. Okay. Yeah, potion of strength too is what we want. And yeah, you just, uh, I don't need any, so feel free to take whatever you need.
All right. Go sleep in our Betty Bays. Okay, let's do it. Where the fuck are our beds? Oh, that's right. Skyland. Sky oh, wait, no. It's daytime now. Never mind. We can't do it. Fuck it. My bed is already here, so. Oh, and mine is at the end portal, which is. Yeah, it's close enough. There's even a horse out there so that I can ride. The back. Mind of Moria. To fight the ball rug. Ball rug fight. Yeah, this is like the true ball rug fight. It's crazy. Crazy that we've never done this. Do you want to spawn him in that empty cavern? Might not be a bad place, but you can just get him to start blowing shit up. Well, yeah, but back into back in like a dark corner so that we can like we have room to maneuver behind us but he's kind of like cornered so we can just you know maximize our arrowage at him no what they're all gonna laugh at you no they're all gonna laugh at you no all right you ready all right here we go let's go actually Let's go in this direction. Okay. I think uh, this would be the safer direction because it's further away from all of our shit. <laughs> Look how far back we dug. Well, I mean, if you if you do in the cavern, he can open up the cavern more. Well, this is all this is all the cavern, and this no, is I all... mean the the big where the where the mine is, where the abandoned mine is. Fuck no, dude. There's too much lava there. Ugh. We're not in the Nether. Okay, let's do this. Actually, no. Yeah, let's go right back here. I just wanted to see what was down here. Let's take it. Right over here. Like back in this corner right here. I mean, yeah, wherever. Well, there's lava behind us here, so we got to be careful for that. Do you have any blocks? Oh, here, I'll place some blocks over this. Or... What about back in here? Like way far back here. Yeah. And then just use this hallway to kind of. Yeah, we can just peg them from four different sides. So, like right here? Right, we... right in this little nook here? Yeah, that's perfect. And then we can just kind of like pin him from, you know, this hallway. We can shoot and maneuver and move. Just tell me when you're going to place the last block. Uh-oh. <laughs> I need to go to the ender chest. <laughs> okay. Okay. Do we have one down here? I don't know. I forgot I did. I had them in the ender chest. That was the one thing I needed to get was the skulls. Um. Yeah, I think we're far enough back that it's definitely safer. Yeah. God, these things make me so nervous. So we've two withers down on this server. And it's going to be three. One, yep, three. And I'm glad that wither and the nether um, never managed to make it down the staircase and like wreck our nether fortress or anything. Oh, I know. Oh, we, we, like, we are super overpowered right now. Like I said, I gained health in that fight. <laughs> it's like <laughs> the wither effect. The wither effect just heal, heals you now. <laughs> yeah. So, I'm good. Alright, that's good to hear. <laughs> okay, I will have this shit in one second. Let me just climb up yeah, I'm just going to hide in the hallway and then away. shoot at him with a bow and arrow. And if I get, you know, if one comes at me, I'm just going to block with my shield. Wait, the skull? Yeah. I don't think you can block them. I think they'll still hit you and give you the nether effect. And besides, you have blast protection. Yeah. Well, the skull gives you wither effect, right? Uh, yes. Wither 2 effect. I, I don't... I'm not positive if the sword will, um... The or the shield, shield will block will actually block that effect from happening. 
Will a cobblestone block it? Will him will a skull hitting an object cause it to detonate? Uh, yeah, I am not. I'm just not sure how the splash damage works and at what point you get the uh, the effect. You know, does it does it have to be a direct hit or is it just if you're caught anywhere in the explosion? I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, I'm going to do my bow and arrow with the shield, and then I'm going to charge him with my totem and sword. Go berserker. All right, well, I'm glad we both have totems, golden apples. Potions. Regen potions. Super crazy uh, gear. Yeah, we've I'll got this shit milk. down. Yeah, we can start just well, farming. considering how much damage I did to him solo in the nether after you died, I think... Yeah. yeah. I think we got a good handle on this. And I, I was, like, navigating around a staircase going, like, lava pouring around. And yeah, I know. It's a goddamn horror show. All right. Down here? Well, you know what? I'm going to place the soul sand here. Just so we have it for later. And don't stand anywhere near him when he's Yeah, spawning. I know. <laughs> No, I'm going to stand way far back and just pick him off with an arrow until he gets low health. Yeah. So I'm going to stand back here and just shoot at him. Just let me know before you oh. hit the block. <laughs> I, put, I put the skull back here. Ah, how do I break it? Can you, uh, do you have a pickaxe? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, Alright, hold on. I'm going to try to break this stone block. Oh, it's still there! <laughs> yeah, let me go get a pickaxe. Do you have any sticks? Uh, yeah, I got two sticks. Here. Well, here, get, get some cobblestone. Uh, do you have any wood? <laughs> Oh, there, there's your sticks. Right here, right here. I have cobblestone. Okay. <laughs> Take it! <laughs> Go craft a pickaxe, hurry! What? <laughs> going. Oh. You know what? Uh, it's it's really funny, actually. <laughs> you make a crafting table. <laughs> Don't we have one over there? Yeah, I know. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's sad funny. Mm-hmm. Here, go craft a pickaxe. <laughs> you know what? I just realized I have like two <laughs> stacks of torches on me. That I should not have all that. <laughs> God. <laughs> of all the stupid fucking things he could have done. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize it was so hard to pull a head back off of something, even though you destroyed yeah. the thing it was on. Uh, you don't need to sleep. You don't have an important day tomorrow. Alright. Alright. Reed, did you get the skull? Yes. Thank you. <sighs> hmm. Okay. I have the soul sand. <laughs> Let's try this there, one more time. All right, you re are we ready? Uh, yes. So as soon as I place this, chug your po your strength and regen. Come on, bitch! I got payback. Oh, put your totem in your offhand, not your shield. No, when I give my sword out, I'll do it. Look at this fucking bitch. Totems in the offhand, go, go. Damn, this hell is done. Milk. I healed you. <laughs> You're fucking welcome. Alright, you got the star? Yes, I do. Sweet! Look at that, man. That, we fucking rocked that. 
Ouch. Yep. I uh, lost that's one a... food food thing. That's it. Yeah, man, that was really effective. Spawning him and just shooting at him from down a hallway <laughs> with the gear yes. we have. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, I didn't get hit once with my bow and arrow. Yeah, yeah, because he got stuck behind that little lip there. Yeah. Well, shit, now that we have a beacon, we can put one here and put one... We can have one at all three wow. of our... Yeah, one here, uh, one at Sky... Or, yeah, one at Sky Island, one at the base that shall not be named. And, oh my god, is that the only minecart? <laughs> oh no, yeah, there is one here. Uh, and then one at the Woodland Mansion? Yeah, because we never activated one here. I mean, we yeah. planned on it for a long time, but we never did. I mean, we built the sand up on the top, we did the pyramid, but... Yeah, let's, uh, let's get some emeralds. Let's start stocking up on emerald. That'll be our yeah. next adventure, is uh, emerald farming. Well, if you want to uh, ever... Not tonight. Ever harvest all of... I have all those vegetable fields. <laughs> that is yeah, emerald fuel. Oh, I know, and that's an experience. I got the wazoo. Yeah, I uh, I have spent a lot of time tilling those fields into the wee hours of the night. <laughs> oh my god, dude, this was the most successful night. What a redempt, what a redemptive arc this whole thing was. Yes, <laughs> we fucked indeed. up. We sat there and overpowered ourselves. <laughs> we leveled up way past where we needed to be. Uh, and yeah, I'm gonna just drop these potions back off in this chest here for future use. Put these bottles Wait, back. I put the nether star in the diamond chest. Uh, in the diamond chest. Okay, and I have one in the in my ender chest. We just got to make sure we never forget where it is. <laughs> let it, let it be known forever. Nether star is in the diamond chest. Sure, don't want to put it in my ender chest with the other one. No, it's going to be up here with, with the um, diamond, so that way we can, as soon as we get the emerald, we can light it up. Alrighty. And then, yeah, we'll need a, so wait, what is a beacon again? I think it's quartz blocks and glass around another star. Pretty sure is how you do that. Look at that. This is fucking fantastic. Oh, and I'll take those buckets back uh, if you have any buckets left because... Uh, I have both buckets, yes, on me. Yeah, because those were... Uh, <laughs> we're so short on buckets, I just want to make sure we don't lose track of any... Uh, like, yeah, put them downstairs. I just can't believe how much of an iron problem we have. I think that's really what we need to do. Like, we need to have a chill stream where we just do a whole bunch of mining because we can use not only use the ore for shit we need, but use it to power the beacons too. So it's like, you know, I think between that and villager trading, we should be able to get everything we need. Where, um, where do you want the buckets? Where are you? Up on the top. The top. Coming down. Oh Stop. my god! Okay, here. I'll take them. I'll put them in my ender chest. And now we can travel back through the nether again. The Safely. The nether is open for business once again. Yay! That was very cool, redeeming, awesome run where we got a bunch of nether stars, which will definitely help enhance... I think some of the characteristics of our fortresses. Yeah, yeah, I'm really excited to, uh, well, and from here on out, I definitely want to find a spot in the nether with the ceiling, you know, to basically do it the, the way that we can just mass farm them without having to do any prep. Yeah, we should, and we should also set one up at the, um, uh, eventually at the ocean monument, so that way we get the effects of both. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I think there's plenty of reason to keep we we could go for beacons forever because beacons stack too so if we put like five beacons at every location we could get every effect at every location including conduits everywhere yeah yeah so i definitely i think it was worth 
doing all that slabbing in the nether, that's what's, what ultimately paved the way for a little bit of an easier time doing all this shit. There we go, and then we... Totems of Undying are all there, all intact. Kevin Costner's Redemption made it in the Vegemite Spreader, which is awesome. I know. It's crazy, though, because now I look at the one that I have, and it's... Well, it's better in some ways. Well, and on that note, sir, I wish you adieu. I will talk to you later in the week, Friday or Saturday. All right, man. It was fun. Yes, it was. Later. Peace out, dude. Okay, golden apple. And, yeah, I think I am going to also log out. Um... Do I want to sleep here? I think I do want to reset my spawn here. So that was uh, super productive. We totally got all jacked up and overpowered and redeemed ourselves. We killed the wither and then we went and spawned a second one and killed the second one. I can't believe it. Fucking sweet. I'm going to call it a night. I will... See everybody on Friday. Peace out.